I am standing in fashion icon Jenna Lyons' closet, and today we're catching up with her to find out what spring trends are on the horizon and how fashion and beauty are becoming more inclusive. Thank you so much for having us here. I mean, you are truly a fashion icon in New York Thank City. You. Can you tell our viewers everything that you do? Um, well, I am the founder of a sustainable and inclusive lash brand called Love Scene. I used to be the creative director and executive president at J. Crew for years. I also am working on a hotel. Um, I'm doing consulting work. I am also doing something called The Expert, which is basically interior design services. So wow, anything you want from me, just call, I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> well, Jenna, obviously you were on top of the spring trends. So what is kind of on hand for spring 2022? One of the things that I love is the midriff. I'm a huge mm -hmm. fan and obviously we've seen a lot of that. I think there's a new way to do that where you're getting a little bit of a sliver of midriff, a little peak. but it's still very sophisticated. I love the after shoulder. I'm never not mad at a shoulder. Um, they're always gorgeous. <laughs> um, and this is also a nice way, you know, I think you're wearing lace today. I think lace is always one of those materials that this guy per lace, which is a heavier lace, so it's not frilly and thin. It's got some guts to it. And this paired with a little bit of a black sandal, a little bit flirty and a very clean trench, I think makes her look sophisticated and crisp, but also a little bit playful. I mean, I mean, gorgeous. Ready for spring. Gorgeous. <laughs> All right, Jenna, what else you got for us? Melina is wearing a jumpsuit. I'm a huge fan of a jumpsuit, always have been. But what I love about this one is this is a sexy, like, going out jumpsuit. Yes. In a simple white silk, so you can definitely pair it with sandals or during the day if you wanted to get a more beach summer look. Mm -hmm. Also going out at night. Jenna, is there anything else that we need to know about what we should be wearing this spring? I mean, I think... The industry as a whole is shifting. I think you're seeing across the board, everyone being included. I think you're seeing, you know, all different ethnicities, women of all shapes and sizes and age, thank you, <laughs> are being included in fashion stories. And I think the rules are disappearing and that's yeah. super exciting to me. And I think it's amazing that you're kind of part of this shift, right? Because you have an inclusive beauty brand. I do. When we set out to create Love Scene, we brought in 21 different women, different ages, ethnicities, eye shapes. And it was really important to us to build the lashes on them so that they could tell us what made them feel beautiful as opposed to us telling them. Well, we gotta top off the girls with your lashes Let's then. Try. Let's I, finish up their look. my favorite then... part. The lash that I'm gonna use for Janie is Cody. The reason I picked Cody is that it's actually a little shorter to the outside oh, yeah. and it's a little longer towards the center. And on her eye shape, her eyes go down a little bit on the outside. And so what it does is it really accentuates this brow area for her. And these are also a mix of brown and black, which is a little bit more subtle. I think it's really nice on someone who has her blonde complexion. Oh, I love it. So for Melina, we're gonna use the Fern Lash. And what I love about the Fern Lash is it's a little bit sporadic. It's not super even, which I think really helps make it look a little bit more natural. It's also a mixture of black and brown and on her skin tone, it looks so natural. Beautiful. Well, you guys look amazing. Thank you, Jenna, for showing us the spring trends. 